Poirier Management Consulting are energy market advisors that have been active in the Irish market for over 17 years. My name is Brendan Cronin, I'm a principal consultant and I advise on a range of energy market topics. I'm going to give you a short overview of how the energy market works on the island of Ireland. Pulse electricity is bought and sold through an all-island market known as the single electricity market. The single electricity market has an annual turnover of 3 billion euros. Prices vary on a half hourly basis because of factors such as demand, wind and commodity prices. Prices in the evening can be several multiples of the price overnight. Gas is the most important source of electricity generation, supplying approximately 50% of our needs at present. Wind supply is over 20% of our electricity generation at present and there's a target to increase the total fraction of renewable generation to 40% by 2020. Since 2012, flows of electricity between the Irish market and the GB market has increased and this means a greater level of integration with other European markets. So there are several different sectors to the electricity market. There are generators who generate and produce electricity and there are suppliers who supply electricity to end users. In between generation and suppliers sits the electricity network. Charges for the use of the electricity network are regulated charges that are set annually by the electricity regulators. These are known as use of system charges. So how is electricity priced in the market today? The current arrangements have been in place since 2007. Generators submit their cost data to a centralized pool. This cost data, along with information on system conditions, is then used to calculate the market price. The market price is calculated centrally, with all generators and all suppliers receiving and paying the same price. So the market will inevitably change going forward. So what will be the drivers of these changes? We at Pori think there are three fundamental underlying drivers. The first driver is a significant growth in onshore wind, underpinned by European energy targets. We expect that Energia will play a significant role in this change, as at present, over 25% of Ireland's renewable generation is supplied through them. The second is increased integration of the Irish market with the wider European electricity and gas markets, underpinned by new EU legislation. The third driver is the need to ensure that while market changes happen, they don't impose undue costs to end consumers. So that completes a short overview of the electricity sector. I hope you found it useful and has given you some insight into how the market works.